What is going on guys? Get you one two three out here back with more spin tires mud runner and today we are back with an awesome live stream and uh, in this one well we're gonna be taking a look at something that we kind of looked at in the past but it's got a brand new twist on it. This is a 6x6 ATV but we're gonna be adding a few additions that just weren't ever on it before. So like what you're probably wondering well for one we're gonna put this thing on the back of it and while well, you might be thinking well what exactly is that? Oops. Uh, well, it adds a seat, and then if we click this right here, look at that! We actually get a second rider on the quad with us. That's actually ridiculous for spin tires. I don't think I've ever seen anything like that in spin tires before. Uh, and lastly, we are going to connect, boom, a six-wheel trailer holding uh, four barrels full of maybe oil or fuel or something. We don't really know what. And so we are here on the new map, Siberia, and this one just came out and it is one of the highest rated maps. It's supposed to be uh, super difficult, but like appropriate diffi appropriately difficult. Um, it's just supposed to be a really good map. So we're going to start driving to the north, and I heard that things get crazy up towards the north. So I'm super excited to start exploring it here with you guys. So I hope you do enjoy this live stream. Say hello in the chat down below. Let me know how you are doing today. And also, uh, drop a like if you happen to enjoy the stream. I'm going to be shouting out as many of you guys as I can who drop a like and let me know. And also, if you happen to subscribe, let me know. Okay, wait, why is this thing going so slow? Okay, maybe it just needs to pick up a little bit of momentum, maybe? I thought maybe we had the parking brake still on, but not really. Not really. So, I don't think this thing's so much built for speed as much as it is just rugged power. So it says that diff lock, oh my goodness, diff lock is always on. Let's go over towards this way and try to hit these logs. I didn't want to miss those and go off that, uh, into that rut to the right there. And there we go. These logs provide a little bit of stability in what would otherwise be probably just a completely muddy trench. Oh my gosh, this mud is no joke. Guys, I've never been on this map before, so you are seeing my real first live impressions. Oh my goodness. This map might be a little bit much for this little old quad here. Or at least, we might have to be taking a different route. It looks like there's a lot of different trails on this map, so if the quad, uh, you know, is having too much trouble, we can always start off on a different, uh, different area. Oh, and real quick, why are we not in full screen? Let's go to settings, enter full screen mode, 1920 by 1080, okay, okay, resume, there we go. And lastly, 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 uh, oh no, I gotta make the chat so we can see the chat, okay, wait, oh no, 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 not main menu, jeez. Uh, exit full screen, that way I can click over here, and now I can see the chat, okay, okay, now re-enter full screen. This game can be kind of a pain in the butt, I don't know. If you guys play this game, then you know what I mean. You know what I mean. If you don't play the game, then you might be like, what do you mean? Seems normal to me. Eh, well, Spin Tires, it has its ins and its outs. And, uh, oh, this is quite the deep rut that we got ourselves in, but it looks like the quad's gonna be able to pull itself up out. Uh, awesome Life, what is up? Thanks for dropping a like, dude. Daniel, Monty Plays, good luck on your test, dude. I will see ya. I will see you later, dude. Uh, Hell God, what is up? Alan Lind, Irishman. Shout out to you, dude. Eric Pierce, thank you for dropping the like. So, wow. This is just like... I can't believe how just thick and muddy and slow this is. All wheels are always on. Diff lock is always on. We can experiment with some different gears. Let's see if by chance, maybe... Different gearing might help us. Ooh, 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 I don't want to go deeper. I, that's, that's the one thing I don't want. I don't want to take it deeper. It looks like up ahead, the some of this mud's going to calm down a little bit. Maybe we'll take it from there. But right now... <laughs> oh my goodness, we are at a crawl. We are at a crawl. I could be, uh, I could use the winch here. I could use the winch, but I don't feel like it is necessary. I think we can get through without it. Uh, yo, Garrett Hall, thank you, thank you so much, my man, for the super chat. That is absolutely awesome. 4.99 super chat. Thank you, dude. You said keep them coming. I assume you mean the videos or the streams. Absolutely. 
Thank you so much for the five dollar super chat. I appreciate that. Hope you have a fantastic day, Gary. Faze, thank you for dropping that like. Uh, KJ, thanks for dropping the like as well. Jaden, happy birthday to you. Gaming Lizard, what is up? Nick Nava, shout out to you, dude. All right, so we made it through the first section of mud, and oh my gosh, I will tell you. I mean, that was, that was pretty insane. That was pretty insane. Let's take a look at the map here and see what we're actually dealing with now that we have a little bit of a, a view on it. Um, how do you zoom in and out? Okay, there we go. These weird inverted controls, I'm telling you guys. Alright, so I guess we'll stay on this for now. We'll stay on this for now and see where it takes us. Or, hmm, you know what? You know what? Why well, go on a straight path? Let's turn off here to the left and see what lies up ahead. I don't want to just drive in a straight line. I actually want to explore this map. Because like I said, the reviews on it are fantastic. People said there's so much to see and it's super well designed. Oh, we're still in the road here. Let's see what One Plus is like. One Plus, baby! Ooh. Oh, wow. Cool hill. Oh my gosh! Oh, wow. I was not expecting that. That is actually awesome. Not many maps just have, like, giant hills like that. Oh, engine is stalling. Right, right, right. There we go. I kind of want to see if we can make it back up that, but that is actually super cool. That's a really good looking hill for spin tires. Oh my goodness. So I guess we'll just continue on this way and uh, keep going along this trail here. That guy is my friend. That guy just did the super chat. Awesome. So you guys know each other in real life? Shout out to both of you guys. Thank you, thank you. Samir, thank you for dropping the like. Jeep guy, welcome to the stream. As always, guys, I'm doing my best to watch the chat here. But if you say something and I don't read it, don't be afraid to send it through a second time. Uh, but as always, do not spam the chat. Please. Don't just go copy, paste, 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 paste. You know, if I don't respond after a couple of minutes, feel free to send it through again. But uh, as always, you know, I'm trying to keep up with the chat as much as I can. Uh, so we've got a river here behind us. We're just going to get back on the path for now. So far, Siberia is pretty sweet. I'm not going to lie. At the beginning, I was a little bit worried just because of the, uh, the thickness of the mud and how slow the pace we were going. But uh, I'm glad to see not the entire map is that. I think that would be a little bit over the top. Over the top. Is that the ATV from the last spin tires? Jeep guy, I think it is. I think it is. My guess is they ported over the model for it, and they added a few things. They made it so you can have these two riders on it, which is really cool. Um, uh, Travo, thank you for dropping the like. I've been watching your videos for five years, Riley. That is awesome. Thank you for sticking with me for so long and growing here alongside with me as we all continue to grow and evolve through the years. Doing it together, guys. Doing it together. Cameron, thanks for dropping the like. Jaden, thanks for subbing. Welcome to the family. Samir, I do remember you, dude. I do remember you. You've got a name more unique than the ones that I'm used to seeing in my streams here, so yours isn't too hard to remember. OMG, my phone went from 43 to 20%. Oh, classic. It must be an iPhone. Is it an iPhone, Jeep guy? iPhones are cool and all, but their batteries are... All my friends that I know, all my friends that have iPhones, the reason that they don't, or the reason that they get new phones isn't because their phone is slow, it's not because their phone is broken. They get new phones because their battery doesn't last anymore. That's like my biggest complaint about iPhone. I'm still rocking the Galaxy Note 4. I replaced the battery, I think twice in four years, and it has slowed down, but like, that's my fault because I have a ton of crap. If I did a factory reset on it, it would be faster. Though. Point is, you gotta be able to replace your batteries. I don't understand these iPhones. Like, people are buying brand new $900 phones because they need a new battery. You know what I mean? It's like, why not just buy the battery? Oh, because you can't get inside of a phone without voiding your warranty and maybe breaking it. Anyways, I'm not hating on Apple. They make really functional products. Expensive, but functional. I'm reliable. Um, I'm trying to figure out the best way to go through here. Killer, what is up, dude? I'm doing great. I am doing great. Irishman, shout out to you. Irishman, dude. 
Ethan, Ethan Doramus, Doremus, welcome to the stream. Yo, Froggy, I'm doing good, dude. You gotta knock at the door. What's someone doing knocking on your door in the middle of the day? I mean, I guess that's a lot more normal than if it were the middle of the night. <laughs> Oh, okay, I didn't see that path over there, so let's cut across here. This thing is always in a state of low and slow, you know? It would be cool to see it, like, if you could give it a lot of, a little bit more, I don't know, fast, powerful revs. Because uh, I'm not in low gear right now, I'm just in normal gear, and I wouldn't mind seeing a little bit more power. I will say, I feel like the graphics on this trailer are really good. I don't know what it is, but the uh, the plated steel there on either side of the barrels, like, it just looks pretty good graphically. Overall, I think this game looks pretty, pretty good. Especially this mod. I don't know. I'm, I'm quite impressed so far by both the, the vehicle and the map. I don't know. You're mining diamonds? What? Are you playing Minecraft right now? Alright, which way guys? Right or left? Right or left? Ooh, cool! So we actually already reached the back of the map. We're gonna go right then. We're gonna take a right because we've got a lot to see. A lot, lot, a lot to see. Timothy Dar, do you remember me from yesterday's stream? I really enjoy all streams I've watched and you are really cool, dude. Dude, Timothy, thank you very much. And I do remember you. Welcome back. You have the same last name as this one girl that I went to school with for a few years. And uh, I remember when I saw your name last stream, it made me think of her. And uh, yeah, that's why I remember you. So I'm going to hit the dislike button because I dislike. That's, that's perfectly fair, man. I can't even get mad at that. That's exactly why that button is there. It is for you to express how you feel about a video. So more power to you. More power to you, my man. Um, I think... Uh, part of me does want to travel up the river somewhat, but I don't know if we're going to regret that. It might just be a really slow trek, but what lies that way? Ooh, cloaking. I think we better hit the cloaking. Just uncover that part of the map. Alex, thank you for the like and sub, my dude. Welcome to the family. Froggy, yes, dude. I know we keep talking about it. I gotta do the Off-Road Outlaw stream. I just, I gotta knock it out. Gotta do it. Since I don't know how... Ooh, that was some nice suspension flex. Can we hit that rock again? Oh my goodness! But what I was saying is, uh... I just gotta figure out how that live streaming software works with Off-Road Outlaws. I've never live streamed a mobile game before, and since I don't know how to do it, I guess I'm just kind of putting it off. Which I gotta stop doing. I gotta stop doing. When are you going to... Do Off-Road Outlaws again? We have somebody asking. Yeah, so it sounds like pretty soon we'll be doing Off-Road Outlaws. I don't know about tomorrow. We'll have to see. Onyx, what is up? Welcome to the stream. Don't hit that dislike button. Hit the sub button and the like button. Thank you, FaZe. Thanks for standing up for me, man. And Jeffrey, I do remember you. Welcome back. What do I think of Ninja? I don't really watch Ninja very much. I'm not a huge Fortnite player. Um, before Fortnite, I had no idea who Ninja was. Um, I just knew he was like good at Fortnite. Then I did a little bit of research, and I found out that he started playing in competitive Halo. And I know there's this one move in Halo that you can do called a Ninja, and it's where you... Let me try to get on the grass here. This is really slow. In Halo, a Ninja is where you round a corner, and you have somebody chasing you, and then as soon as you round the corner, you jump up and backwards, and they chase you around the corner, and then you melee them in the back and you get the kill. It's one of the coolest ways to get a kill in Halo. I don't know if that's named after him, because it's called a ninja, or is it just because you're killing them like a ninja, like jumping behind the backs? Yo, Hayden, what is up? Definitely use Mogus and Live or one of the others. They all work fine. Just make sure your device has enough RAM. Cool. Thank you, Froggy, for the uh, for the info. Because that's what I use, Mogus and. And I'm rocking the Note 4. And it has either three or four gigs of RAM. So I think we should be good. Alex, thank you for the kind words, man. Look at us, guys. We are just out here in the middle of the Siberian. I was gonna say plains, but this is not really a plains. It's just a big wide open area. 
Ooh, this is getting deep. I don't have anything to winch on to either. Oh boy, no, 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 no. Please tell me there's a winch point. No, wait. Remember when I told you guys at the beginning of the stream that the northern part of the map gets really tough? Oh, this is the eastern, wait. Oh no, this is the northern side. Yeah, here we are on the northern side of the map, and uh, that wasn't a lie. The northern part is quite tough, quite tough. We might be rescuing to the garage here. Are there any winch points at all? Let me see. I doubt it. I, I really doubt it here. No visible winch attachment points. I'm not too bummed out if we have a rescue to the garage. Ooh, hold on. I do see us moving. Before we give in completely, let's just drop down to a low gear real quick. Ooh. Low 2 is treating us a lot better. Maybe a low 1 even for good measure. You can see we are really deforming that mud in the front, shoving it upward. Jose, welcome to the stream, man. You didn't miss too much. Don't worry. You're the only YouTuber I'm sub to that's not playing Fortnite. I don't know what it is. Fortnite just doesn't do it for me. I, I could go into why I don't like Fortnite, but I think you guys have heard me talk about why I'm not a giant fan of it. I don't dislike it, but I just don't love it like everybody else. Um, Austin, yes, my man. Sorry, I missed your message. I am using mods. Both of these are mods, so this map is a mod. It's called Siberia. Um, crap. I don't know what to do here with... Alright. I should have just kept my speed there. I should have just kept my speed. I don't know about this. This is a bad idea. This is a bad idea. Let's see if we can just drive in through the grass a little bit. Let's try dropping a, uh, ooh, jackknifing. Whoa, 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 whoa! Jeez. If you guys haven't noticed, this thing has steering in the front and the back, which is really weird. And it turns very slowly. Look at the fastest I can turn the tires. Pretty slow. So it's kind of hard to control. If you guys want me to talk about why I don't love and adore Fortnite with everybody, like, the way everybody else does, I'll talk about it. Do I play GTA 5? Heck yeah, dude. Heck yeah. Guys, I think we're going to rescue to the garage. We just ended up in a really difficult part of the map for now that might not be cut out for a quad. Um, and I don't mind rescuing because when we do, we're going to end up right here. It's not like we're going back to the beginning. We're going to the center of the map where we can just start exploring a different direction. So, I think that's what we're going to do. I think that's what we're going to do. Is it easy to put the mods into spin tires, or is it pretty complicated? Austin, it is easier than ever, dude. Um, let me rescue to the garage. It is e it's so easy. Spin tires is one of the easiest games to install mods on that I've ever played. Okay, rescue, recover to the garage. So you buy spin tires through Steam, and the way that you install mods is through the Steam Workshop, so you know they're safe, and you click Add to Game. Boom. Done. That's it. You, you pick out the one you like, and you click Add to Game. Um, so what's really amazing about it, real quick, let's re-add all the things we had, which is really just a trailer. I'll show you guys some of the other options that this thing had. Um, there's another trailer option. This thing looks pretty sweet. I mean, that's, that's a cool trailer, too. Uh, it's got some Russian text on the back, but I kind of wanted to do the six-wheel trailer. I don't know. Both are cool. Both are cool. Or that one. But, um, do you like chicken sandwich? What? Like food? Heck yeah, dude. Who doesn't like chicken sandwiches? All right, let's go out to the... Well, it's getting dark. I am gonna wanna skip night here, but I don't think it's dark enough yet. Um, uh, let's go out to the right. Yo, Rona Edmondson, you said it's your first live stream. Welcome, 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 welcome to you. I'm glad you decided to tune in. Glad you decided to talk in the chat. Albi, welcome to the stream. Thank you for the like, Albert. Appreciate it, dude. 
Alright, so I think we should be able to skip night now. Apparently not. Let's wait a little bit longer, but hopefully we should be able to skip night real soon here because I hate nighttime and spin time. I just, I don't like it. I don't like it. Mike, uh, I do remember you, dude. Welcome back. I think you're the only sub named Micah or Mika. I'm not entirely sure how to pronounce that, but uh, welcome. Can you put the four-wheeler on a... Oh, put on the four-wheel trailer. Yeah, you know what? Now that you say that, maybe I should have. It's kind of late now, but now that you say that, I should have just given the four-wheel trailer trailer a try. Uh, what? Are we out of fuel? Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, okay. Let's try this one final time. Recover in the garage. Let's try out the four-wheel trailer as you guys wanted. Would you consider doing a how-to on installing the mods? Um, probably not. Probably not. And the reason is, one, it's so, so easy. I mean, do you already have Steam? If you have Steam, then uh, you do it all through the Steam client. And second reason why is there's probably already a video that shows you how on YouTube. You know, I don't want to just rip off somebody's video and make the same video, um, unless it's not already up there. But I think there's probably already tutorials, so. My Wi-Fi's acting up, I'll talk to you later. Remember Off-Road Outlaws tomorrow. Froggy, I will do what I can, man. No promises, but if it's not tomorrow, I'm definitely down to, uh, to stream it very soon. And even to do a video or a stream with you at some point, I'd be down. Fanta, well, thank you for the like and the sub. Welcome to the, uh, welcome to the family. Hmm, that's cool. There's like a church over there. MX versus ATV or GTA 5, which one is better? Oh, GTA 5 for sure. For sure. Wow, guys, I just realized something! <laughs> the four-wheeler was never the problem. The problem was that we were hauling a super heavy trailer. Oh my gosh, this is so weird. I'm glad we tried this other trailer. I didn't even consider that uh, maybe that trailer was just super heavy, but this one's already way lighter seeming. This is a really cool part of the map. This is a nice, nice map. We will definitely be returning to this one. <laughs> Jeffrey, I already told you, I remember you, man, I remember you. I don't know, I can't remember if your name's actually Alex and you changed it to Jeffrey, but regardless, I remember that you are the Jeffrey slash Alex. You like the other trailer better. I kind of like this one, I don't know. It's, it's lighter, so we're able to get around a lot better. Um, wow, this map actually feels like it has character. Like, look at this. There's buildings spaced out, kind of like where buildings should be. There's roads every which way. I mean, this is actually really sweet so far. Oh, Fanta, shout out to Australia, man. Just last night, I was going, I had a wave of curiosity come over me. And out of nowhere, I Google searched population of Australia. Because I live in the United States, and here in the U.S., Trucks with no lumber. Okay. Good, good, good. Here in the U.S., we have a population of 330 million, 340 million, 335 million, somewhere in there. And so last night I was just thinking to myself, Australia, Australia is just some island. Like, what is their population? And I guessed. I was like, okay, I'm gonna guess before I look it up. I was like, um, I don't know, 150 million, 200 million. And then I looked it up and found out Australia only has 24 million people. That is insane. That's less than the state of California. Uh, let's try going this way. This looks pretty cool. Yo, Gaming with HB, thank you for dropping a like. Gitchy, I can't change it. If I do, my parents will get me in trouble. No problem, dude. No need to change it. I know that you are Alex. Even if I call you Jeffrey, it might just be a slip of the mind. I know who you are. I know who you are. Can you put a snorkel on that mod? 
It's definitely doable, but I'm not a modder, so I can't do it. And it's not like an add-on option. It would require an actual modder to go into the files and, you know, mod it in. Brody, thank you for the like and the sub, my friend. Why are the tires always clean? They're not really. If you look now, they're totally caked. Uh, if we drive through water, they'll come out clean. Um, yeah, setup tour is coming. I'm getting a bunch of camera equipment in the mail tomorrow that is going to turn my GoPro into a really good vlogging um, So, yeah, I've got 150 bucks of equipment coming in the mail tomorrow. Am I going to do an LSPDFR video? I did a LSPDFR video yesterday, and I found out that I... Excuse me. I basically forgot how to play LSPDFR. I basically forgot how to play it yesterday. I watched a tutorial yesterday after the stream, and I was like, wow. Like, looking back, I did a kind of a really poor job with LSPDFR. So, um, there will be more LSPDFR coming. There's like five more essential mods that I need to install that really expand the game. And, uh, the LSPDFR videos are about to get a lot, 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 lot better. I'm super excited to bring more LSPDFR. Um, they're going to be really good. You should do Spin Tires Multiplayer Stream with Tomcat. You know, Tomcat and I, we like tweeted back and forth, or he DM'd me one time, and like, we talked about, you know, doing a, a, a collaboration, and we never got around to it. It's kind of weird. Now I haven't talked to him in years. Like, we messaged each other maybe twice each, and now I haven't spoken. Well, I've never spoken, spoken. I haven't chatted with the guy for probably like two or three years now. So at some point, yeah, I should reach out to him and be like, you know what? Let's do this. Let's do this, Forrest. I even know the guy's first name. He has the coolest name of anyone I've ever heard. TC's full name is Forrest Bird. How cool is that? Unless that's a fake name or something, but like that is like one of the most unique Forrest Bird. Damn, I wish my name was that. Uh, do you have to install the mods from a PC? I mean, mods only work on PC, so yeah. You you can't install mods, like, on your Xbox yet. It's just, they haven't added support for that. I don't know if they will, but yeah, these are all PC mods. If you don't have a PC, unfortunately, you will be playing, uh, playing with people. Kitchy, if you have roommate, can we say hi? <laughs> uh, currently, he is at work. He is at work. He actually gets home in like 20 minutes. But, uh, yeah. I look so different. Well, I don't know. Depending on how long it's been since we've been here, right? I guess I grew a bit of uh, a goatee. And in the last few months, I put on like 15 pounds, which is pretty sweet. So maybe my face is starting to fill out a little bit. But I've been trying a lot harder to eat more and uh, just stay on top of my meals, basically, and not ignore being hungry. Sometimes I would just sit through being hungry because it's like, eh, eh. And then 10 minutes later, the feeling's gone. And, like, I've gotten a lot better at like, actually eating when I feel hungry. And so getting weight now, starting to work out, starting to put on some muscle, all that good stuff. So maybe that's why I looked at it. Someone else told me, they're like, you look a little different, but I can't put my finger on it. And I was like, I don't know, is it my, my goatee? And they're like, no, I, I just, I don't know what it is. So, who knows? Who knows? Gangster Gamer, do I remember you at all? It's hard to say, man. Hard to say. Not so sure on that one. I don't want to mislead you and lie and be like, yeah, man, totally, pound it, bro. I don't lie to you guys. I don't, so. Gangster, I can't give you a yes on that one, unfortunately. Brody, thank you, thank you. Can we say hi to him when he's home? Um, I'm in a little bit of a hurry. We'll see, we'll see. I have to wrap up the stream around 5.30 and rush. I have to jump in the shower, rush to band practice. Um... My friend is out of town, and I'm, i got to feed his dog and let it outside and stuff. I'm supposed to do that before band practice. So it's going to be a little bit of a mad rush. Okay, I don't want to be... I 
don't want to be in these stumps. I always hate these areas that are just like a bunch of cut down trees. If you're in it with the wrong kind of truck, you can get just completely stuck. I believe that if you hook up your computer to your console, it will install the mods or put the mods on a flash drive and put it in the console and it will install one or the other. Are you sure? I feel like I would have known about that by now if you could honestly install a console mods. I think they're just entirely not supported, right? Do you like gangsters? Um, I guess it depends what kind of gangsters. Gangsters are cool as long as they're not like... I don't know. Like, I don't want gangsters who murder people aren't so cool. But if it's just like a cool group of gangsters, sure, sure, I like me a gangster. I don't want them to like hurt me or my family or my friends. Since generally isn't implied that gangsters make money by doing illegal activities. Gangsters don't follow the law. That's what makes them gangsters, right? If you were, there's no such thing as a law abiding gangster. Or maybe, yeah, you know what? There could be. Depending on how you look at it, there could be a law abiding gangster. If you just want to be a real G, but still follow the law. Someone, there's a meme in there somewhere. When you, when you want to be a real G, but still follow the law. Or something along those lines. And then it needs a picture to go with it. Yeah, Brett, I'm using the Xbox One controller here on my PC. Can I play Off-Road Outlaws with you? We do need to have a multiplayer day. I will, I will do that at some point. Have you stopped looking at your live chat? Absolutely not. Uh, gaming, thank you for subbing and liking, dude. Welcome to the family. Guys, why don't we go ahead and get the first like spike on the stream going. Let's also check out One Plus. I want to check out the fastest gear this thing drives in. Alright, so anyways, drop a like down in the chat below, tell me, or drop a like down below, tell me in the chat that you did. I'm going to be shouting out as many of you guys as I possibly can. Who drop a like? Ooh, look at this. We are playing some mud. We're just going to leave these tires spinning so we don't stall. Oh my gosh. This is what I was talking about when I said I wish this thing had a bit more torque. Whoa, 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 whoa. No! What? We're still good, boys. We're still good. <laughs> I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I thought we had to recover in the garage from that for sure. I was like, no. Wow. That is actually crazy. I can't believe we recovered from that. We're still a little bit caught up. I do not want to roll this thing. I don't think... Oh, I was just about to say, I don't think it would roll, but look at this. <sighs> okay. Oh my goodness. Okay. Maybe let's try the winch. Maybe let's try the winch. I don't want that winch point. No. How does this work? Uh, stop quick winch mode. No, I want the other winch. You know what? I'll just try it. I'll just try it. No, no. That winch point's totally not gonna work. Release the winch. There we go. Yeah, you yeah, go. Yeah. Uh-huh. Are we gonna pull the entire bridge out of the water? What car do I drive? I drive a 2012 Mazda 3 hatchback. I like it. It's super fuel efficient, gets 39 miles per gallon on the highway, yet it's got a sporty look to it, and it's a hatchback, so my roommate Kevin and I, we can put both of our uh, mountain bikes in the back. We put down the back seats, take off our front tires, and we can fit a couple mountain bikes in it. It's awesome. It's awesome. Jeffrey, or Alex rather. <laughs> I'll see you later, Alex. Have a good one, dude. If you ever see me driving like totally erratically, it's probably because I'm looking at the chat and this thing handles very weirdly. Like here's the fastest I can turn. I should show you guys. Let me show you. Like say we're going straight 
and I start turning... Well, hold on. This isn't a good spot to show you. Oh, I totally forgot about the like spike, guys. Can we redo that? I, I feel bad, because I already missed all you guys. Um, yo, Glorious Ghost, Higginbotham. I went to school with somebody of a, a name similar to that. They have the same last name. <clears throat> Tell, or Tamara Paris friend me. I don't friend anybody, but if you guys want to friend me, you can. I may or may not accept it. We'll see. It depends on what game it is. If it's like, um, Fortnite, I'll accept the people. Okay, anyways, yeah, drop the likes down below, or maybe you already did. Tell me in the chat if you dropped a like. Well, this time, let me not forget to do the likes part. Let's not forget. Do I drink G Fuel? No. I, I don't drink any energy drinks. You guys shouldn't either. You don't want to drink energy drinks. Red Bull, Rockstar, Monster, Java. Stay away from those guys. They're awful for you. Like, like, horrible. Just so bad. So bad. Edwin, of course I remember you, dude. I don't know why, but I didn't even have to think about it. Edwin Ortiz. Um, when are you going to do more Robert Outlaws? And when is your vlog channel happening? Vlog channel's happening very soon. Uh, the equipment for the vlog channel is coming in the mail tomorrow. Coming in the mail tomorrow. <laughs> Welcome back, Robbie. Certify. Thank you for dropping the like. Um, okay, so RC Madhouse, thank you for dropping the like. Uh, God's Swift, thank you for dropping a like. Is your username Gitchy1230? Why, yes it is. Uh, G Fuel, no. no. Is that the powder one that you just mix in a drink? I don't do powder mixes with water. I don't do energy drinks. Um, honestly, even things like pre-workout, you ever hear of like taking pre-workout before you go weightlifting? Even pre-workout is unnecessary. It's loaded with sugar. It's just about as bad as drinking a Red Bull before a workout. Um, a lot of scientific studies have already shown that uh, if you want energy before a workout, you can drink a coffee before. And the caffeine is fine for you. Uh, it'll still give you a energy boost during your workout. Just don't get dependent on coffee. You don't be one of those people who drinks two cups a day and suddenly gets a headache if they don't have their coffee. You know what I mean? But that's my job. I'm just trying to keep you guys away from energy drinks because they don't even taste that good. And they're just utter crap for your body. You, you gotta care about your body. You have to. I love my monsters. <laughs> I don't blame you. Well, I don't know. I can't say I don't blame you. I do blame you, because I don't drink them. No, but I have a lot of friends who drink them and stuff, and people say they're actually addicted. I don't know. I don't know. Um, a few more likes. Hunter, Ivan Master, Brett, uh, 2023, Estanis, Estanisoloa Bori. <laughs> I probably ruined your name, but thanks for the like. Yo, what is up, Brian? Uh, what do I like better, GTA 5 or Spin Tires? In my opinion, they're hard to compare. They're two very different games with two very different genres, and they're trying to accomplish two very different things. Are they both open world? Yes. Can you drive vehicles in both of them? Yes. That's about where the similarities end. Having said that, I guess I would have to say I like GTA 5 better. But I, I wouldn't really compare them. Do I like Ford F450? All Ford's new trucks, I think, look pretty sick. Whether it's the Raptor or the F150 or whatever, I think Ford's new trucks are looking really clean. <laughs> I'm a fat guy, okay? I like cake and energy drinks. <laughs> I feel you, man. I feel you. <clears throat> I think I need to eat more cake. That's my problem. I need to eat more cake. I was just talking about how I gained like 15 pounds in the last couple months, but... Can we refuel here? No, this isn't a refuel point. But, uh... I'm trying to gain weight, but, you know, I don't want you guys to think like, uh... Oh no, I'm getting... I'm getting fat! It's like, no, I need to gain weight. If anything, I'm underweight. I need a little bit of fat on me, and then some muscle. Did we really just hit a dead end here? 
Was this really just a dead end cul-de-sac? That's upsetting. I did not play Far Cry 5. I've never played a uh, Far Cry. How do you get the best camera angles? Do you mean in this game? It's kind of tough. It's really touchy. I don't know. Carefully. Or do you mean this camera angle? Because if you mean this camera angle, I don't know. I just set it there. <laughs> Monster has horse pee in it. Ha! <laughs> That's hilarious. Alright, Fanta. I'll accept it next time I'm on. And next time we do a Fortnite Friday and I play with you guys, uh, I'd love to play with you, man. If you're around for Fortnite Friday, um, you can just join my lobby and I'll invite you, dude. Alright, so we're gonna have to go back a little way in this. Gotta go, class just started. See you later, Estanisloa. <laughs> There is one place in the world, except your home country, where would you choose to live? Anywhere. Oh boy, that's a tough one. I don't know if I've actually put much thought into that. Um... Climate is pretty important to me. It needs to be something comfortable. Ideally somewhere that has a natural, a beautiful natural world around it. Um... Gosh, that's really hard. Which way are we going? Okay, yeah, we'll go this way. My dad's girlfriend made me a red velvet cake with cream cheese frosting for my birthday. I ate it all the two pieces. Red velvet cake with cream cheese frosting. Mm. Cream cheese frosting is always the best. Like, anything along those lines. Cheesecake is awesome. Uh, key lime pie I love. Oof. Um, how many Fortnite wins do I have? Like, I don't know if I have a solo one. I don't know if I even have one. I have a few squads and a couple of duos. Because sometimes the camera is on the side. Sorry, Xandri can't talk. My sister's calling me. I'm gonna reject her call and she'll probably call again. Um if the camera's yeah, I don't know. I just move the camera carefully. Okay, so if I had to move somewhere in not America, where would it be? I don't know, there's so many places I want to visit, and I don't want to commit myself to anywhere for too long. Um, I don't know, maybe somewhere that's like always not too hot. I don't, that's a really, I'm sorry I can't give you an answer. <laughs> Let's go with somewhere in Europe. That is so vague and broad, isn't it? I don't know. What's the best place in Europe to live, guys? What's the best country as far as just overall living circumstances? RC Madhouse, I feel you, man. Rounding up all the equipment you need for uh, an RC channel. It's a lot of work, dude. It's a lot of money. Yamaha Junkies. What is up, dude? I'm sitting here with my Yamaha keyboard right next to me. Shout out to Yamaha. Yo, Hunter Hewitt. Shout out to you, my friend. Thank you for being here, dude. Thank you for the kind words. Uh, I only have one sister. She is my only sibling. She's about four and a half years older than me. About four and a half years older. Only sibling. It would have been cool to have a brother. Um, not gonna lie. But my sister's not, like, a girly girl by any means. If anything, she's you know, pretty outdoorsy. And, I mean, <laughs> if she has to get her hands dirty, if she has to get her hands dirty, she can do it. She's done it before. She, like, raises her own chickens for slaughter and stuff like that. She doesn't slaughter them herself. She takes them somewhere, but, um... I mean, one time there was this one chicken that was sick, and she had to put it out of its misery herself, and she, she did it. She took a 22 out back, and, you know, she did the chicken a favor, because you don't want to have it, like, sitting there suffering for hours or days, but... And when the going gets tough, she can do what she has to do. My sister is starting her own blog as well, so you guys are going to get to know her a little bit better here in the future. She's starting kind of like an outdoors blog, um, 
about just kind of like a lot of things about horticulture and sustainable living and um, like mushroom hunting, a whole bunch of other things. In fact, the blog, her blog is already up. If you guys want to check it out, um, it's called mildly, it's a website, mildlyoffensive.me. That's very important that you remember the domain. It's a dot me domain. Mildly offensive dot me. I think her last blog was about mushrooms. Can you lower the volume of the game? Thanks for letting me know. Should have done that sooner. Uh, F2, I don't have an RC channel yet, dude. What gear have I been in this whole time? Okay. Um, the way the RC videos are going to work is... Uh, Initially, I'm going to upload all of the RC videos to this channel. We're going to start here on this channel. I'm basically going to play it from ear, or play it by ear after that, in deciding whether or not to start another channel, or... <laughs> um... Hmm. I think these two dudes are going to drown. I think this is where it ends for them. I think this is where it ends for them. But anyways, yeah. Um, what was I just talking about? I don't remember. I don't remember. Well, I guess we're going to have to go back to... Where's the garage? There it is. Recovering garage. What is up, Hunter? Happy birthday, Team Epiphany! Welcome back to another stream, dude. I hope you have a great birthday. I hope you get everything your little heart ever possibly desires. I hope it's fantastic. Shout out to you, Link. Thanks for being here. I have chickens and ducks, but we have them for eggs. That's cool. We had ducks when I was growing up. We still have chickens out back. Um, they're more of a breeding project of my sisters, but they give us eggs too, so it's cool to be able to wake up and have just like fresh eggs out of the back. You should call your RC channel Maximum RC. I don't know what I would call it. Gitchy RC or... I don't know. You should put your sister's channel in the chat. Sure, you know what, I'll... Or actually, I'll do that as soon as the stream is like, over. I'll do it at the end. Um, Cause we gotta end the stream soon anyway. I gotta hop in the shower in a little bit. Gotta rush a shower. Just gotta go as quick as I can. Gotta leave the house then. I don't wanna make uh if I show up late for band practice and I hold up everybody else, you know. Just so you know, my channel is kinda set up for future use to make sure I actually carry out my plan of a channel, but thanks again for the sub. Uh, <laughs> I know how that goes, RC. You set it all up ahead of time and have everything in place for when you actually start. Can we skip night now? Yes. Jaden Stangland. Uh, there's a lot of Jadens. That's the only thing that makes it tough, is I've had a lot of Jadens swing through my videos. So, if I said I remembered you personally, it would be a little bit of a fit, so I'm not going to say that. Regardless, welcome back. I'm glad you decided to see that. Hmm. Froggy, have a good time grilling, man. Have a good time grilling. I would love to do some grilling tonight. I do have an Instagram, and you guys should all follow it. You guys should all follow it. I uploaded yesterday. Everybody who drops a like on my new Instagram photo right now, I'll shout out here before the end of the stream. My Instagram is gitchy1230yt. The YT stands for YouTube, so... Let's take this for a quick spin without any... I just want to see how this compares to when we started. We got a new puppy named Jax. He's a German Shepherd. That's cool. My friend actually got a puppy a year or two ago. And he named it Jax as well. So, um, I actually just saw. Uh, or no. Never mind. It was his brother. I saw it. <laughs> Let me take that back. But yeah, Jax was a cool dog. Man. I don't know how we got through this the first time with that trailer. I really don't. I really do not know how. Because this stuff is thick. There we go. Less wheel speed actually really helps. As soon as you rev it, it's kind of gets a little sloppy. 
You had to sell your chicken? No! Amy Oak Bros, happy birthday to you! I hope you have a great one. I hope you have a fantastic one. Alright guys, so here's what I am going to do. Let's put this over here real quick. Um, my Instagram is gitchy1230yt. My sister's blog is mildly offensive. Let me make sure I spell that right. Mildly offensive dot me. Copy and paste that URL. It doesn't look. Let me try it as a www.mildlyoffensive.me. I don't know. The, the www didn't turn it into a URL. Um, I cut my hand open with a buck knife a while ago. Gonna go get stitched up soon. Oh. Uh, my roommate that I live with just sharpened his buck knife a couple days ago, and he took it across. He has the actual proper sharpening thing and uh he got his butt knife real sharp a couple days ago crap i just realized i can't see the chat i just realized i can't see the chat well regardless though guys i think i should wrap up this stream i think it's time to wrap it up here for me because uh we've done everything that we set out to do here today so um thank you guys all so much for being here today i had a great time hanging out with you guys had a good time hanging out. Tomorrow, I will be back with some kind of video. I'm not entirely sure yet. Um, maybe some off road outlaws. I'm not entirely sure what I would do with off road outlaws. Is the thing. We'll have to see. But, uh, let me bring up the chat here one final time. Where are we? Where are we? There we go. Um, oh, yeah. So let me shout out those Instagram followers real quick to those of you who did drop a like and then we are going to get the stream completely officially wrapped up 13 new likes on my photo nick nava thank you dude for going over to the instagram b 900 101 j football for life Real Albie, thank you, Albie, for uh, dropping that like, man. Dice likes rice, or dice, yeah, dice likes rice. Chris, uh, Chris Estelle, uh, one, two, three. Thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you for uh, swinging by my Instagram. Make sure you drop a follow. All right, on that note, I'm going to get this wrapped up. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I love you all. I love your faces. Have a great night. I got to get in the shower and go to band practice. So... Peace out.